you can build the iconic energy sword from the Halo video game series and TV show. We've upgraded our original project to feature motion-activated sound effects powered by CircuitPython and the prop maker Feather RP2040. This dev board is our favorite go-to because it's designed for making prop projects. It's got the RP2040 chip with built-in audio amplifier, accelerometer, and 5-volt NeoPixel level shifting. CircuitPython has made our prop maker project so much easier thanks to our new demo code and libraries. Dev boards with CircuitPython are great for props because they load just like a USB flash drive so you can easily edit the code and drag and drop audio files. You can customize the LED effects and change the sensitivity of the accelerometer to better fit your projects. It's got different modes of interactivity that work really well for most projects. When the prop is idle, the LEDs slowly fade with a looping sound effect in the background. When the accelerometer detects a swing, it triggers a blast style effect with swooshing sound effects. Heavier motions trigger a bright flash of light with a harder hitting sound effect, and you'll get a bit of randomness each time it triggers. The code is easily adaptable, and because it's CircuitPython, you can make an edit, hit save, and quickly see your changes without having to compile the code. You can get the parts to build this project, links are in the description. We designed the CAT assembly to feature a more rigid structure with updated internals for housing the electronics. Free CAD files are available to download in the project's learn guide. The blades are 3D printed in white translucent PLA filament. The pieces feature sturdy mounting tabs that are attached together with steel machine screws. Mini skinny NeoPixel strips are wired up and fit neatly along the inside edge of the assembled blades. The speaker press fits into a 3D printed holder and is secured inside the handle along with the prop maker feather. A mini slide switch fits snugly into the built-in holder and a 2000 milliamp LiPo battery fits under the dev board. Wires from the two NeoPixel strips easily connect to the prop maker feather thanks to the screw block terminals. Mounting tabs on both sides of the handle are wedged into the blade that feature additional mounting holes for attaching them together. We had a lot of fun updating our energy sword with new features and think we've made it easier for folks to put together. We hope this inspires you to check out Adafruit's CircuitPython and PropMaker Feather RP2040 for your next prop project.